Probably after it looked like the game might not go ahead, um, a terrific performance on the road and three points as well. Yeah, excellent. I thought first half we were superb. Really, really good. Um, I put on the on the board inside the change rooms three things I really wanted to, to see from the game, and that was the desire to block and tackle and be aggressive in our play against the ball. I wanted to see our physical data being really high. Um, and I wanted to see quality on the ball and I, I, you know, for large periods of that game, especially first half, we showed that in abundance. Second half, the other side of the game, um, sloppy goal to concede, shouldn't, shouldn't be tackling in the box, shouldn't really get there in the first place. Um, but again, this, this, this young group of players sort of dust themselves down and, and, and sort of went again and um, great for Jake to get the couple of goals, he's, he's needed that. Um, his work rate is never in doubt, but his you know, centre forwards always like to score. So, really pleasing day. Um, felt we deserved it, and yeah, we're good value. Just talk about that first half performance because you've obviously set sort of targets and goals for, for the game and the first half in particular. You must have been pleased with how they carried those out. Uh, I was for sort of 40 minutes, I thought towards the end of the first half, we got a little bit sloppy in our play, and it gave them a bit of encouragement. They had to, I don't know if you noticed, the goalkeeper went down injured in the first half which meant they could make a tactical change and all 10 players go over to the touchline so they changed and that's that's obviously because they felt that we were on top in the game um, but the second half was more bits of bits of quality but it was just a desire to keep the ball out the out the goal and all, all for a, a mistake which led to another mistake for the penalty I, I felt that we, we weren't extended too much in that you know there's balls coming in the box but we're heading them we're being in the right positions at the right times. So substitutes come on and do a really good job for us. So really pleasing away victory. Always nice to win away from home. Um, and like you say, it just makes that extra half an hour on top of the uh, the game even sweeter for us. How pleasing is it as a manager when you get the first half performance display like we did and the second half we showed sort of maybe the other side of the game in terms of being resolute and keeping the ball out the, the goal? You're away from home. You're not going to have 90 minutes of... of dominance if you like and I use that word I thought first half we were good and second half you, you're right sometimes you're going to have to roll your sleeves up you're going to have to defend your box you're going to have to press you're going to have to tackle you're going to have to clear your lines don't be a snob don't be, you have to tip your tap out of your own 18 yard box you're going to have to clear your lines and get up behind it and we recognise certain situations where we can do that a little bit better don't get so panicky in our clearances but you know we, I keep saying it This we're young and the learning on the job but days like this makes it makes the progression of these players even even better to see and just for Jake Beasley as well two goals to his, his name today um, the great the first goal was a lovely goal through from Old Connolly took it well and then the second was a real poacher's goal wasn't it good play good play for both goals um, I felt in the first half as a team we should have scored more I thought we scored some fantastic situations um, but Jake he's been telling me for weeks it's coming now I said well just bring it. Don't keep telling me that. Just, just bring it. And so his confidence. So you know, we never doubt Jake when, in his work ethic, what he gives to the team. But ultimately, we want him in the team to score goals, and um, he'll be he'll be well pleased with that. And hopefully, now he can kick on and, and go on a little run. How good is it to have him up there? You know, we talk about his goals, but for the other side of it, sort of as, as an outlet for the defence to to find him up from. Yeah, great. And. I've said before, we've got to be careful not to abuse that sort of work rate. Um, so the quality into him has to be good because he will chase lost causes sometimes. And I think you, know, you might as well save your energy for when, when the ball's right for you to chase. But that's him. He's got an honesty about him. I think this squad has an honesty about it. Um, everybody in there is together. And with the supporters backing us like they did today, hopefully they're all catch trains at the right time if they've gotten booked and all the rest of it. I think, like you say, coming away from home, tough place to play, good team, and to take three points home is fantastic. Two two wins on the spin as well. I know you said before the game you want to start a really good run. It's a, it's a good start to that, isn't it? Four unbeaten, two, three away games in that, tough places. Um, so, yeah, we're not getting carried away. I, um, I never get really low when things aren't going well. I never get too high when they're going fantastically well. So, try and keep that middle ground because I think that's when I make the better decisions when the emotions are taken out of it a little bit um, but two cup games now we want to progress so that's the next challenge for the players I know you just briefly mentioned the supporters then but great backing from them once again ah, 
I can't. Do you know what? My, my first job in as the manager of the football club, and I've got supporters travelling in bad conditions, late kickoff, and the stay till the end, and support was through. It's it, it makes me proud to 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 be the manager of their club, club if you like, and I'll make mistakes, and I think everybody would accept. You know, everybody's trying to do the right thing for the football club, from the board right down to to everybody in the in the building, including you guys. So. Um, Enjoy the victories, but we want more.